We know the month of October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and the goal here is to encourage women to keep up with their breast health. Abby Larico verifies the best ways to monitor and detect breast cancer. You will hear the phrase early detection saves lives, and that's because doctors will widely agree taking action quickly can make a huge difference in breast cancer treatment and outcomes. So what is the guidance for how to detect it and monitor your breast health? Let's verify. Our sources are several sets of guidelines and breast oncologist Dr. Claudine Isaacs, who points out there are different guidelines from different groups. A screening is checking for a disease before any signs or symptoms. For breast cancer, that typically means mammograms and physical exams. Those leading breast cancer organizations may recommend mammograms beginning at 40, 45, 50. Some will say annually, others say every other year. Those at highest risk might be encouraged to get a mammogram even earlier. Age, family history, ancestry, inherited gene mutations, personal health history, and lifestyle all could factor into how early, how often, and what type of screenings should happen. The National Comprehensive Cancer Network does recommend people have a breast cancer risk assessment by age 25. What we're really trying to do is to figure out how to get more personalized at this. Along with regular well woman visits with a health care provider, the advice has long been to conduct monthly breast self exams. Now guidance on that is divided. Dr. Isaacs says it's most important to recognize lumps, bumps, changes in texture or pain. What is important is that people know what their breasts feel like. And if they notice something that they go and they have it checked out. She adds the best guidance for you will come from the health care providers who know you best. Those are conversations that have to happen on a regular basis. The great thing about medicine is that our knowledge keeps on evolving and our guidelines change as a result. So because you had that discussion 10 years ago doesn't mean that it still applies to today. All right, good info there. Carrie will have your storm tracker forecast in 30 seconds.